Hi, this is John Leslie. This user story mapping template allows you to see the big picture product forest through the individual user story trees. User story mapping brings a logical order to your stories as they pertain to the expected user journey through your product. Let me show you how to use this template. So any product begins with this prioritized list, otherwise known as a backlog of themes broken down into epics, broken down into user stories or features. Now a product backlog, of course, gives you an excellent way to prioritize by business value, what should be worked on first, as well as give sizing estimates, but it's not a good way to see how your customers are actually going to interact with your product. That's where user story mapping comes in. So you see over here on the right, we have our first pass user story map where we're mapping through our expected user journey from restaurant search to restaurant details to finally making a reservation at their selected restaurant at the epic level. So you can see these epics are added from the backlog to this user story map. And that's as simple as doing a drag and drop like this. Now, if we wanted to prioritize reservation confirmation a little bit higher, we just drag it up the list like this. Now we have some context as to how at the epic level people customers are going to be using our product now this further breaks down in a second pass user story map to what eventually will become your release plan so you see here we have a swim lane representing release one mvp release two release three if we expand this you can see here we're now adding user stories to this user story map so we can get more specific, more detailed as to actually what we're going to deliver in, for example, release one, our minimum viable product. So here, for example, reservations, let's flesh this out a little bit more. We'll open up this reservation confirmation over here in the backlog to expand it to the user story level and drag and drop just as we did with the epics. And maybe we want to prioritize text confirmation over email confirmation. It's as simple as dragging and dropping it above email confirmation like this. So there you have it. An excellent way to visualize your product backlog, your themes, your epics, and your user stories through your expected customer journey with user story mapping. Thanks and good luck with Favreau.